but the show last night was incredible. Just crazy, like this Jakarta is so big. Like how can you not move a little bit when you hear this? What's up Medcom, I'm Benson Boone and today I'm gonna to be doing a little interview about my singing and songwriting, so here we go. How's it going guys? My name is Benson Boone and I am an American singer-songwriter. So let's talk about your song In The Stars, which is big at TikTok and almost been all social media. How do you feel about the, the response that you've been getting from social media and how big it's gotten? Did you expect this initial response to it? Um, I definitely did not expect the type of response that I got from In The Stars. When I originally wrote that song, I didn't think much of it. I didn't really like it very much. I don't know, it's always weird because I, I never listen to one of my own songs in the same way someone else does. Because when you write a song, it just, it just I don't know, it, it seems very different. I was very shocked when it got shown a lot of love on TikTok. I did not see that coming. In the way that it did, I'm so grateful for that. I mean, you know, it's like one of my favorite parts, my concerts, to perform that song. And you know, that, that song helps a lot of people, so. I'm, I'm grateful for it. Um, do you want to talk briefly about the Asian songs? I think it resonates with a lot of people. That's why it's so big. You want to just talk about that? Yeah, so In the Stars, I wrote In the Stars about my grandmother, and she passed away a couple years ago. And I think, you know, as a human being, uh, I'm, I'm bound to lose people that I love just as anyone else is. And with that, you know, sometimes we take for granted. Uh, but our memories, I think you can always remember someone when they have le left your life. And that memory of someone is, is very important. I obviously have my memory of my grandmother, but I think something needs to be done when, when someone passes away. It's like something needs to be done to get over it. Maybe not get over it, but to come to terms with that loss. And writing in the stars was that for me. But I think the most beautiful thing about this song is that writing this song is how I got over the loss of my grandma. But now other people can listen to that song and use it to help them come to terms with the loss of someone that they know and someone that they love. I think everyone understands that emotion that I felt when she passed away. At some point in, in people's lives, like they're going to understand that and in the stars will always be there. What was the process like in the creation of that? Um, Pulse. Pulse came together over the course of like a year. Yeah, it's just like a compilation of songs that I'm, I'm very proud of. And I think, like just, just as a movie has a trailer, I think uh, Pulse is kind of like the trailer for my album, which I'll be releasing here in the next couple months. But yeah, these are songs that I love, songs that I'm very proud of and songs that are very meaningful to me. So I wanted to give people a variety. I don't think any of them are the same. Like, like the same vibe. Sometimes people will release like projects that are all like kind of the same vibe. And then this one is like, every song is completely different. So is this your first time in Indonesia? This is my first time in Indonesia, yeah. Indonesia is, has been really cool. Like obviously I haven't been here very much. Like I haven't spent a lot of time here, but the show last night was incredible. The view from my hotel is just crazy like this, Jakarta is so big. The food's been really good. I like it a lot, but I would love to spend more time here. Oh yeah, I wanna, I think I'm gonna come to Bali in December, not even for music, just with my friends. So yeah, I, I really, I would love to come back. What is it called? Dandu? Never. Uh, -uh. I think the only time of Indonesian music I've heard of is Jadag Jadug. Oh yeah, I heard you say talk about Indonesia. Yeah. Um, we're gonna have you listen to this type of music, and I just wanna know what you think about it. Okay. Like, how can you not move a little bit when you hear this? I don't know what they're saying. You gotta look at the lyrics. Okay. 
Twitch. I think it's kind of funny. Um, well, my opinion would probably be a lot different if I knew the lyrics or like what it was saying, but I think it's, I think it's kind of funny. I think it like, I think it's cool and fun and good, but I, I think it is like, yeah, I think it's funny. It's just very common in Indonesia. Well, it, it is more of like a dance type of song. Okay. It's very common. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. I can see that. It is kind of a dancey song.